What's up my peoples? Welcome back to another episode of The Wheel Life. My name is John and on today's episode I am going to review a really awesome adaptive cup holder that is called the Handy Cup. So without any further ado, let's get into it. Let's go. <laughs> All right guys, so it's been like two months since I made my last YouTube video. Um, as you can tell, I'm not very good at this whole consistency thing. But anyways, I have been posting on the Wheel Life official Instagram page. I'll keep a link to that in the description below. And we have really been creating this really awesome community for people with disabilities. About a week ago on the Wheel Life official Instagram page, I made a post talking about the cup holder that I use on my chair currently. And the cup holder that I use now, it's not like an adaptive cup holder. It's just a regular, I think it's meant to go on like bicycles and motorcycles. And I picked it up off Amazon for like $9. So real steel, real cheap. And it just is so much less expensive than a cup holder that's say marketed towards disabled users. And in the comment section, to that post, I actually connected with a fellow quad like myself who actually creates and sells his own cup holders. I thought that was super cool and we talked for a little bit and he said, you know what, I'm gonna send you a cup holder and I want you to try it out. And I said, sure, I'd love to do that. So that's what this video is about today. So we're gonna kind of compare and contrast my $9 cup holder in comparison to the cup holder that he makes specifically for wheelchair users that runs about $50. I just wanna give everyone a heads up watching this. You might think I'm like getting a paid endorsement through this whole thing, but that couldn't be anywhere farther from the truth. He said, I want your honest opinion. I'm gonna send you this cup holder. And so that's what I'm gonna give you guys my honest opinion on is the Handy Cup cup holder worth it to spend $50 versus say the $9 one that I've been using from Amazon. So let me tell you what I think. My dog's excited, I'm excited, let's go. All right guys, so I'll start by showing you my $9 cup holder from Amazon that you really can't see on this video, but I will put up a picture of what it looks like. Um, just like I said, it's $9 from Amazon. It's not an adaptive cup holder. It is just a regular bicycle slash motorcycle holder. And that's really the plus side of the whole thing. It's $9 where a handicap one is like $50, but there are drawbacks to it. Like first off, I could never put it on by myself. I need help to put it on. I had to wait around for people to be able to take the time and hook it up for me. The other downside to it is that it really only fits like two kinds of cups just like a standard water bottle or like the smaller Yeti that I picked up off of Amazon. I will put links in the description below about the cup holder and the cups that I use that will fit in it. But like I said, it's really only for small water bottles. I can't fit like this big cup. I can't put a coffee cup or I can't put a mug in it safely. So that's kind of the downfalls. Plus side is that it is real cheap. Um, and it works. All right, so what's really awesome about the Handicap is that it requires no tools and it can fit pretty much any wheelchair that you have, whether that's a power chair or a manual chair or like a scooter. So even someone like myself with zero hand function can order one of these online, have it sent to me, and I can put it in all by myself. So that is a huge plus because anything that makes independence easier for people like us is fantastic. So let me show you one way that I like to use my Handy Cup cup holder. What I first do, is you see the cup holder itself and you see the big long stick. So what this long stick thing is, very technical terms, right? Um, you take it and you put it right underneath your cushion and between your seat pan. So you stick it like that and you pop it in. And now that it's in place, it is very secure. It ain't gonna go anywhere. And I can wheel and be about my business. It can fit like any cup that I need to take. Well, let me show you. So, my water bottle holder. Boom, my giant blue cup. Boom, my Yeti coffee mug. Boom! You know, if the situation calls for it, 
and I feel like carrying around a giant bottle of hot sauce. It can also fit my Dunkin' Donuts coffee, which again will not fit in my $9 cup holder from Amazon. So that is boom. And last but not least, it can also fit a wonderful Bob Ross mug. It says, no mistakes, just happy accidents. Boom. What he also did, which was pretty smart, so if a cup is like real short and you can't see like the top of it or something, it came with this piece right here that you just drop in the bottom and now the cup will be raised up like uh, an inch or so. Another great thing about this cup holder is that it doesn't just have to be in one spot, right? So if, say I don't like it here, what I can do is I can take it out and I can stick it in the front of me like so, and now I can put my cup in there, you know? So I can just push and wheel and it's right there. And if I wanted to order two more and I wanted to put them on both sides, I could, have, I could be a tri drink holder. All right guys, so what's the verdict? Would I buy a $50 cup holder versus my $9 one that has worked for like, I don't know, quite some time and I haven't had any real problems with it or frustrations with it. And my complete and honest answer to that is if you have the money, if you have the $50, then the Handy Cup blows my little $9 cup holder out of the water. It's so much better. It's better made. It's got way better ease of access for people with limited hand function like myself. I can take it out, um, move it around and it can fit any cup that I need which is huge because you know, I just don't always want to drink out of one specific cup and it can also carry my gigantic bottle of hot sauce around. But that being said, if you don't have the funds for something like this, then my $9 one will get the job done, but you really just kind of have to stick to like a water bottle. So at the end of the day, the Handy Cup is far superior. It is a better product and it is also quad owned. So that is really awesome. This guy broke his neck in like, 2014 and he came up with a solution to a problem that many of us have. So I'm gonna put the link to his Instagram in my description below and we're actually gonna be doing a giveaway on one of these. So if you follow our Instagram pages, you will see the giveaway and you yourself could get a free handy cup. And so this wasn't a paid promotion or whatever, just two quads coming together to see which cup holder works best and I'm not gonna lie, I was wrong, his is better than mine. So I hope everyone has a great week. I hope you're staying safe, hope you're keeping the faith and be on the lookout because I have another couple products that got sent to me that I will be testing out very soon. God bless, let's go.